Why did the Senate use an existing bill that passed the House in July 2019 to create the CARES Act? I was looking at H.R. 748 CARES Coronavirus Aid, Relief, and Economic Security Act on the Congress website. I was surprised to find that the bill originally passed the House on July 17, 2019. I found this strange because the coronavirus was not known until the last few months of 2019. I looked at the original bill from the House. It is fairly short and has nothing to do with coronavirus, but instead talks about removing a specific tax related to healthcare. I took a look at the Senate amendment to the bill. It says, strike all after the enacting clause and insert the following. This is followed the very lengthy text of the CARES Act. It does not contain any text related to the original purpose of the bill. Why did the Senate use this bill instead of creating a new one? What happened to the original? Since the Senate replaced its text, can it no longer fulfill its original purpose? The reason for amending this bill instead of the Senate creating a new bill was to fulfill the requirements of Article 1, Section 7, Clause 1 of the Constitution, also known as the Origination or Revenue Clause, which states that all bills for raising revenue must originate within the House of Representatives. Note that despite the Senate seemingly being able to dictate the content of the bill, the House still has to approve the amendment. The Senate has decided that it is legitimate to fulfill the letter of this clause, if arguably not the spirit, by replacing the entire text of a bill originating in the House with a bill for raising revenue. The constitutionality of this decision has been examined by Rebecca M. Kisser in her 2013 paper. The Shell Bill Game, Avoidance and the Origination Clause. Dot. In Chapter 2, Subsection C2, she notes that while the Supreme Court has never ruled on this, several state courts and lower federal courts have condoned this interpretation. The original bill is now one and the same as the CARES Act, and you are correct in saying that it can no longer fill its original purpose, as the original wording has been completely removed and replaced by the Senate amendment. 